Hello friends, welcome to my channel. Today our topic is Togafi. And I expected with Togafi uh, two parts. First part will introduce few topics and later and the remaining will discuss and second part video. So welcome to my channel. Please subscribe to Tech IT Insights. The, what is a Togafi? So Togafi is an open standard and if it's open enterprise architecture methodology framework enter the world leading organization to has to go for the business improvement they have to follow this enterprise architecture standards among the that we conduct our enterprise architecture better way to include your uh, daily business this standard has to follow this what is the enterprise architecture the well definition of participatory conduct enterprise analysis design planning and implementation using the uh, approach all time of success uh, development encourage in strategy enterprise architecture applies here and structure of the togafi togafi contest has seven parts one is uh, introduction second is architecture development we can say adm adm guidelines and techniques and fourth architecture context framework and fifth is enterprise continuous and tools sixth is togafi reference modules and seventh is architecture capability framework and ADM and we can see in each one in, in details one by one and ADM for ADM ADM guidelines technical architecture we can see the diagrammatic representation how it will be there now ADM part will be the first this part one has exclusion of the overview core concept definition and part two is architecture development method and Part 4 is architecture context framework and enterprise continuous and tools, reference modules, architecture capability frameworks. The type of architecture here, the first will be uh, Togafi is now on 9 cover of development for related types of architecture. One is, we can see the business architecture, data architecture, application architecture, architecture technology, which is the business strategy governance organization the key business process he has to follow and when you come to the here logically and data data assess, assets and data management resources has to be applied and third one is blueprint of of the individual application the relation that which is relationship core business process then we can see the information system architecture data architecture plus application which is business process business architecture, application architecture is services and we come to the data, data information and technology, hardware and software network with part of here. And Togafi capability frameworks, architecture capability frameworks part 4 and the application development methodology, ADM guidelines and techniques which we will apply here. There are two verticals in between business visions and drivers and business capability. When it comes to the first Togafi capability framework, information and structure capture the capability and you will go to the sales target and KPI base and then will back here the business capability and efficiency. Now welcome and the architecture capability of point of view, the operation methods and how your business needs to the method identification and then architecture context framework in fourth and context framework methods of this repository classifications and enterprise confidence then you can see the enterprise continuous and tools which is to copy reference module modules uh, which is operation challenges and continuous repository here as when enterprise continuity will be into the current stale stage this is we can say this diagrammatically that Togafi enterprise continuous and tools need to the business of a non architecture box of you in the business architecture operation. Now, third one you go for this second one is architecture development methods. We can say ADM, it is a very main uh, one of the part is ADM. Here, primarily phases is there A, B, C, D, phase A, B, C, D, E. F G H. We can see the A is uh, in terms of diagrammatically architecture visions 
and which will high level of module capability building blocks and B is business architecture and where is C is information system architecture, D is technology, how technology is adopting you to enter the business, the op opportunity and the solutions, how you are frequently uh, the opportunity you are gathering that. The migration F, migration planning, uh, D is implementation governance and H is architecture challenges and management which is we are facing in our here. Now if you see the in details in the step 1 business description C target architecture model it has to follow and whereas select avas and checklist points has to follow and grab the analytics and complete target architecture point of view. Now if you see the phase A architecture vision what is the architecture vision what is the object to and steps and if you follow this object to and that what is the inputs and what will be the outputs. You can see here and the object to management common committed architectural life cycle ADM. So, whereas you have described the uh, appropriate solutions then what the step is review the uh, principles include the business principles, define the scope, define the characteristic and define this business variation and then input has to be a strategy you have to follow and principal enterprise and the output will be there approve the statement and then scope of the consistency and plan for the architecture to works and basic business reasons one and baseline data architecture methodology and where you have to verify the output will come here. Yes. You can see the document here and ADM guidelines techniques third one is ADM techniques. What are the techniques he has to follow? The self guidelines techniques which is set the it has set as a guidelines techniques of to ADM which is rotation of iteration of the ADM and architecture landscape, security architecture, SOVA and where you are architecture principles and the business scenarios and gap analysis, migration planning and business transformation, so readiness and skills management. Now fifth is architecture contest framework, this part of TOGAFI contest framework which has significant TOGAFI and the diagrammatical has been certain. This architecture principles which is comes to the business strategy, technology and business principles and annual architecture requirement, requirement constraints and assumption and gaps. When we come to the business architecture model, what is here? the motivation and, and organization and the functions. When it here it has to be the architecture realization will have to be there and information systems, data and application and the technology architecture will be come to here. This is part of fourth architecture content framework. So content method meta models has to follow this provide a comprehensive checklist and uh, output the promote the better work product and it provide a details open standards how architecture should be described. And 